Hi, my name's John. I'm a maths tutor and secondary maths teacher. Today I'm going to help you with some of the more common problems that you'll see in maths. Let's work out the surface area of this triangular prism. The key to working out the surface area of a prism of any shape is realising that you just need to find the areas of each face. Here we have three distinct shapes of faces. We have this triangle here, we have this rectangle on the side, and we also have a rectangle on the base. We notice that there are two of these triangular and two of these rectangular side faces, so if we work out the area of them once, we just multiply that by two, and that will give us the surface area we need. So let's label those faces. One, two, and the bottom is three. We also need some dimensions. So let's say we have a height here of four. We have a base here of two. These are all centimeters. Let's make sure we have our units in there. We have a diagonal length here of three centimeters. And finally, a length of five centimeters. This is all the information we need. First of all, let's work out the area of the, of the surface one. The area of one is one half multiplied by two times four. Eight multiplied by a half is four centimeters squared. That's because the area of a triangle is one half times base times height. The area of two is 3 multiplied by 5 because it's a rectangle which is 15 centimeters squared. Finally the area of 3 this base here is 5 multiplied by the base of the triangle which is 2 which is 10 centimeters squared. What we do now is we add these two together 15 and 4 to give us 19, so that's the area of 1 and 2, 19 centimetres squared, and we know that if we multiply this by 2, because there are two of each face, we get the, air, the surface area of all that combined. So this gives us 38 centimetres squared. Then we add on the base, which is 10 centimetres squared. And this gives us the final total surface area. Which is equal to 48 centimetres squared. Just to recap, the first thing we do is we work out this separate surface area of each surface. So we have one, two and three. We work out the area of one here by doing a half times base times height. We work out the area of two by multiplying three and five. And we work out the area of 3 by multiplying 2 by 5. We then add the first two together because there are two of those surfaces on the prism. Multiply this by 2, that gives us the total surface area for those four faces. We then add the surface area of the base, 10 centimeters squared, and this gives us the final total surface area of the prism. And that's how to work out the surface area of a triangular prism.